Okay, so in this video, I'm just going to try to get you started with Blogger. So let's uh, let's enter Blogger. Likely they'll have it like this. And let's say you want to create a new blog, you can go right here. And this is what it looks like when you get started. Um, the title, let's just say we put and history. Okay, so that'll be your title. And let's say you want to make an address, math, sci. And that's available. Okay, so you've titled it, you've given it an address, you can pick a theme. So create the blog. And you don't need a new you don't need a new domain name right now. This is fine. So here's your new blog. This is what it looks like, brand new. So you can get rid of this. And the first thing you'll want to do is you'll want to start with some post. So let's go to new post. And we'll title this first post. Here's your title. First post. Okay. This. And we'll start with the first one. We'll just publish. And there you have your first post. Now, um, let's add let's add another one. Do new post again. Post. This is my second post. Let's publish this. There goes your second post, and we'll even add a third one. And you don't have to publish it real quickly. You can save it, um, preview it. Let's say you want to do a quick preview. This is my third post. Um, but let's just for now let's just publish it. So now you see you have three posts right here, and let's just say you want to take a quick view of the blog, see what it looks like for now. And here's what it is. You've got third post, first post, second post. Okay. Now it looks a little bare, but uh, you're always going to add to it. And here's your third post. Click on it. See, this is my third post. You can click this little share icon. You can share it on Twitter, Pinterest, email, things like that. Um, let me go back. Math, science, and history. So this is just what it looks like. You can take a look at any of these posts here. You can go back and edit them. You can view them. You can delete them. So let's say, you know what? I, I, I don't like what I have for my third post. I'll press delete. Are you sure? Okay. Now that's deleted. Maybe you want to edit your first post. And go, oh, okay, I want to add some more to it. Uh... Here you'll just update it. Okay. Let's say you take a look at your second post again. And you want to add a label to it. Okay, you can add a label. You can say this This will be a sample post. And now, if you take a look here, you go to update. And you see at the side sample post, this is the little label that's been attached to it. If you go to first post, you can go to labels. And you can just add sample posts of that as well just by clicking that. Done. Update. Now the good thing with uh, Google Blogger, with in terms of education, you want you can use this as like a running list of assignments, like exit tickets would be the best thing. They could just type in what they learned for class, and you can keep it as like a running history of what they've learned. Um, there's other things too. You can you can check comments here, stats, how many page views. Um, for the Google Certified Educator Level Two exam, they're not going to get in too deep into detail. If you want to just lay out. There's all stuff you can do here. Like you can add a, see where it says add a gadget? This is, scroll down, add pages. Okay. Title this page, let's say page two. Whatever. Save. And don't forget to save the arrangements. 